Good afternoon, YouTubers. I was only supposed to get two or three, but I overbought. I went to I went to Ollie's first because that was along the way, and I got seven rose bushes there, and then I went to another um, Aldi store, and I got two of my favorites. The John F. Kennedy, a real beautiful white rose. But we're going to do the same thing i done with the other ones. I'm going to cut a hole in the bottom. Stick it in top here. Give it a little drink of water. And I'm probably going to get outside today and put a few of these in the ground. Probably this bucket here first, because these are the better. These are a little bit better than the Aldi. Because it says, it says premium rose bush. And they're both out of Tyler, Texas. But these ones here are bigger and older. They've been growing in the ground longer. You can tell by the size of the roots and the stems and the stalks. But you get... You get more more junk wrapped around there, more sawdust with the package. I don't know if I can get this one in here. Close enough. And the same process with these. I, I try to get a variety. I think I've had a Tropicana before. That's kind of like an orangish bright red rose cut the wires cut the bags and when i go outside i just cut the bags completely and shake the shake the crap off and we'll go through these real quick you don't need to see me cutting the bottoms White Lies, a two-tone. It looks kind of like pink and red, maybe a tinge of yellow in there. O.L. Weeks, looks like a nice dark red rose. I couldn't find the Oklahomas. That's, that's one of my favorites. Of course, I only went to two stores today. Moonlight Magic. I'm not a fan of the lavender roses. I had... um. The Bride's Dream, a darker version of lavender, but they had only lasted, you know, once they bloom, they only last a, a day or two, and then the blooms get droopy and fall on out. This one says love, kind of like a red and white. It almost looks like my other favorite, um, the dual, dual Delight. It's like a red and white one. Gold Glow, a big yellow one. We'll see what that looks like. And Gypsy, that kind of looks a lot like the Tropicana. But you don't know that they start growing. And a lot of times, both of these come from Tyler, Texas. So um, I think they hire a lot of help. They can't read the labels because a lot of times... What, what what grows out of the rose is some, not completely different from what's on the picture. So I think those guys are just slamming the production out and getting paid and out the door. No quality control. But for that price, you're still beating the local nur nurseries and gardens that want 25, 35 bucks for them. God bless the YouTubers. I got to get some gardening done today.